to part three. Uh, I've already got all the joints together. I got the pins in. And uh, now I'm gonna do a, uh, a center post. And this post will be dovetailed. And when it's dovetailed, it'll be interlocked into the center of these boards to help pull these two boards together. That way, uh, as they age, they don't begin bending. Uh, but these, uh, the center brace will hold them together. Let's look at how I make that dovetail now. So I'm going to mark this out right at three and a half feet. This is half the width of the timbers. And this is where I'm going to um, cut in my dovetail joint. So the joint that I'm going to be putting here is five and three quarters um, five and three quarters wide. So half of five three quarters would be two and a half three quarters would be what about there? So Mark needs to be right here. And right here. get the square and mark this out. So these will be where our timber will go. Let me mark this out. One mark. Here is two marks. So in preparation for the dove joint, I'm going to remove just a, about an eighth of an inch of material out of this square where the beam will fit in, and then I will dovetail it the joint end. And for those who don't know who what a dovetail is, dovetail is just a way of um, joinery. You know, watch you'll see what it is this time I'm going to take our handsaw just cut down just a little ways I get ahead of myself I should probably mark out how far well let's go about I'm gonna do about half an inch let's see half an inch is about right there Let's cut this down to about half an inch. And 
Um, let's do the other side. So let's uh, remove this material. As you see here, I've already marked out where we'll be making the cuts. This X is material that's going to be removed. Um, so what we're going to do is we're going to take the handsaw and follow this line and cut this section out as close as we can. And then we're going to finish the rest with the chisel. So we're going to start chiseling out some of this material, but as we chisel out this material, we want to start further back and not all the way here because we don't want to run the risk chopping in too much. So we're just going to remove the material a little bit at a time. That way we can make sure that we're not removing too much. So, here's the dovetail joint. See what happens is, I'm going to make the other beam to fit in here, and then the dovetail joint here will fit into and lock inside to where it can't pull back out. And we're going to do this to the other side too, that way over age, when this beam naturally is going to want to bow because it's going to follow the course of the grain from the tighter to the loose grain. It's going to want to bow this direction. And when it bows this direction, this interlocking joint is going to hold it from, uh, from bending out a joint. Also, it's going to supply a center brace for the flooring that we'll put in on this platform. So as we can see here, I have finished the second dovetail joint. I've got that one over there and this one here now finished. So now we need to cut this, mark this one out, and cut it to fit in these two joints. So, 
I'm gonna cut this off right here because I have this great big knot and I don't want that knot being my dovetail joint because that knot is a weakness in the grain and I don't want that there. So I'm gonna cut that off. Look at that nice cut. Okay, so what essentially is happening here is I'm creating the other dovetail joint. And as you see here, I got it marked off where that dovetail will fit in there. And I've marked off the pieces that I gotta cut out. To make cutting this little wedge out easier, see these wedges here, is I'm gonna first remove this bottom piece. So with the saw, I'm gonna cut that bottom piece out. And then when that's open, It'll be a lot easier to stick the, the saw through here and cut it through this way and, and remove this wedge here. So let's get to it. There's a lamb that is fairer than pain, and by faith we proceed afar. For the Father waits over the way to prepare us a dwelling place there. So there it is, the dovetail joints are done from that side and that side where they're joining together, holding the frame together. Now, next video, we'll be building the, uh, the beams, or, um, the uh, walls here. So, see you next time on the next part. God bless.